Colorado's governor says he's looking into re-examining the 2019 death of Elijah McClain, a black man who died in police custody. In August, three white Aurora police officers detained McLean as he walked home from a convenience store while wearing a ski mask, which his family says he wore because he was anemic and would get cold. The officers said they approached McLean because of a 911 call about a suspicious person. He resisted arrest, insisting that he hadn't committed a crime. No, no, I am an introvert. Please Stop. respect Tensing the boundaries that I am to. speaking. Stop relax. tensing up. Stop. Relax. Stop. I'm going home. Relax or I'm going to have Leave to change this alone. situation. In body camera footage, McLean tells officers he was resisting because he was trying to stop his music. The officers, who say he reached for a gun, force McLean to the ground and request more units. They threaten him with a stun gun and later with a police dog. McLean repeatedly says he cannot breathe. A police report says McLean briefly lost consciousness while in a chokehold. The officer released him and McLean struggled again. Paramedics arrived and sedated him with ketamine. A district attorney says McLean suffered a heart attack in the ambulance and he was declared brain dead three days later. He died three days after that. The autopsy report doesn't list a cause of death, but shows a therapeutic amount of ketamine in his system. Intense physical exertion and a narrow coronary artery were determined to have contributed to his death. Outrage over McLean's death has been reignited in the wake of George Floyd's death while in police custody and the worldwide protests that followed. More than 2.6 million people signed a petition pushing for a new investigation into his death. The officers were placed on administrative leave but were later reinstated. Governor Jared Polis signed an executive order Thursday appointing the state's attorney general to investigate whether criminal charges are warranted. For Newsy, I'm Johanna Grenaway.